Hello, I'm Tom Williams from the Fort Huachuca Public Affairs Office, and this is your Fort Report. A ceremony was held to promote Brigadier General John Morrison, the Commanding General of U.S. Army Network Enterprise Technology Command, or NETCOM, in front of Greeley Hall on Fort Huachuca. The Commanding General of U.S. Army Cyber Command addressed the gathering. Everything he's done turns to gold. And so while promotions are often based, often people think they're based on performance, they're actually based on potential. So what's so significant about this ceremony is that for general officers to get a sense of where it sits, there's about a little over 300 general officers active duty in our Army. Half of those are one stars. And so you can see that, John, you're like in the top 200 now, about a 500 and 10,000 man active, little over 1 million total Army. And then General Morrison received a second star. The original flags authorized for general officers were boat flags scarlet in color. They were first authorized in war dated 22 August 1903 for use of officers of the Army when making official visits to Navy vessels. The oath of office was administered and then General Morrison made remarks. It is just an honor to be a part of your team, an absolute honor. I look forward to the challenges that are in front of us because I know if any team's going to embrace change, lead change and drive change. It is the NETCOM family. So my hat is off to you. Thank you for making this a very, very, very special day. Before becoming the commanding general of NETCOM, General Morrison served as the commanding general for 7th Signal Command Theater at Fort Gordon, Georgia. That'll do it for this edition of the Fort Report. Have a great day.